Good morning and welcome to Dartmoor. Um, I'm just uh, right at the very edge of the moor, up the north, uh, just along from Cleve Tor. I've just started off from Bellstone and uh, I'm out for four nights. Uh, just So I've just had the first night and uh, I'm on a mission. And the mission is to visit all of the White Tors. This is the third white, not counting where I slept last night, which was high up, an outlying outcrop of high white. I'm not counting that one yet. And here we are. It's not the most impressive, but it's alright. Nice views. Oh, yes.
so yeah um today we came down um came down over the the ridge so we came off of uh high white down to longerford litterford Prockern, and then dropped down to two bridges um took the road into princetown um just couldn't be bothered to flack over a moor for a very little return so road walked into princetown um filled my face there had a pasty a cup of coffee um bought a few snacks um and then headed out and um didn't do what i was planning at all didn't go out to didn't go south um i didn't go over um north Hesfri. i just took the railway the old railway track out um towards king's tour but um well, i actually had a little um side trip out to ingra tour which was lovely i've not been there for nearly five years now um and then just um came back along the track and then up onto great mears and uh yeah done the 20k again today it's um it's been you know it's been a good walk it's been quite pleasant um couldn't avoid um getting soaked um basically to cross the river to get to my camp spot so uh yeah end of the day with wet feet uh, hence the uh, the socks are hanging up the shoes are mm, a bit minging really but it'll be all right in the morning Well, good morning. Uh, camp number three. Um, so, camped up below, uh, I think it's Greener Ball, is this this hill just behind me, just up there. Okay. Uh, yeah, so Greener Ball, um, which is sort of like the back end of uh, back end of uh, Great Miz, uh, beside the River Walkham on the little shelf. Um, it's obviously a popular spot because uh, I found a tent peg. Found a tent peg. So, um, someone's obviously been here before and uh, also found their poo, um, which is good. Uh, it's in the obvious place um, with some paper. There's some rubbish I'll pack out of other people's, but I draw a line at toilet paper. So, anyway. Uh, Come out here when the sun's not in my eyes. Yeah. So uh, the plan today is to head up on, up, up on this hill behind me, and just over there is White Tor and Little White Tor, and that will be numbers five and six of the Whites, uh, which will basically mean I finished. Then all I've got to do is get back to Bellstone, and uh, well. That largely depends how I do that largely depends on how I feel where I fancy going and whether any mates are coming out to camp tonight because uh, if so obviously we'll uh, we'll arrange a spot that's convenient for them as well so anyway we'll uh, we'll go and have a look at white shall we So, as you can see, I'm heading for White Tor. You can just see it in the distance. It looks a lot further away than it does on the map. So, sort of glad I uh, didn't push on to there last night. So, uh, I was ready to stop. There was water. And if I'd 
pushed on. I'd only had to lug the water all the way over there. There's none between there and and there. So yes, just heading out, and looks like we are approaching the stone circle. Hello, this is uh, Little White Tor, so number five or six. Behind me, I don't think you can quite see it, somewhere up there, is White Tor itself, which uh, this is a subsidiary of, and uh, that's the last one. Nearly done. <laughs> of six mission accomplished except it's not quite so I'm a white tour so down near uh, Peter Tavi the car's in Bellstone that's quite a long way away you can't, I can't even see where that is so um, most of today um, it's just after 10 now mission accomplished uh, most of the day is basically walking back to the car or to near the car. So uh, the plan is to have one last wild camp as far north as I can get, re within reason, and uh, easy walk out tomorrow for a nice breakfast. So that's an inch tour over there where I've just come from. It's a pretty pathless terrain. It's got the old animal track that's going in vaguely the right direction. Bit of a slog. Looking round. All those lovely tours, which I'm not going to. And this is my world.
yep, you guessed it. More long grass, more soggy patches, more hard work. Whew, still, there's Lintz Tor over there. Possibly where I'm going to stop for the day. Uh, to see if I've got anything left by the time I get there. Still, it's not far now. Well, morning, last day, just walking out to the car now, it's a nice camp on Lintz Tor, it's uh, quite, quite early, so uh, just decided rather than linger and have breakfast and, and all of that, I would uh, walk out and have a, a fry up, so yeah, so that's what I'm doing now, I'm just uh, walking the tracks really, keep it nice and easy, so uh, and then we're done, nearly there. Thank you. 